Welcome to Academic Gain Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between scalar quantity and vector quantity. A scalar quantity is one that has only magnitude and no direction, so it is merely a number accompanied by corresponding unit. For example, length, mass, duration, speed, etc. are scalars, so they have no direction. In every direction its value will be exactly same. A vector quantity, on the other hand, mandatorily has magnitude with unit and a specific direction. So specifying the direction of action along with its value or magnitude is mandatory while defining or stating a vector quantity. Displacement, weight, force, velocity, etc. are vectors, and thus have specific direction of their application. So vector quantities can be either one-dimensional, two-dimensional or three-dimensional parameters. So, Let's look into the basic differences between scalar quantity and vector quantity in a tabular form. Difference number 1, scalar quantity has only magnitude, but no direction, whereas, vector quantity has both magnitude and direction. Number 2, every scalar quantity is one-dimensional, whereas, vector quantity can be one, two or three-dimensional. Number 3, any change in scalar quantity is the reflection of change in magnitude. Whereas, any change in vector quantity can reflect either change in direction or change in magnitude or changes in both. Number 4. Scalar quantity cannot be resolved as it has exactly same value regardless of direction, whereas, vector quantity can be resolved in any direction using the sine or cosine of adjacent angle. Number 5. Any mathematical operation carried out among two or more scalar quantities will provide a scalar only. However, if a scalar is operated with a vector then the result will be a vector, whereas, result of mathematical operations between two or more vectors may give either scalar or vector. For example, dot product of two vectors gives only scalar, while, cross product or summation or subtraction between two vectors results in a vector. And, difference number 6, few examples of scalar quantity are, length, mass, energy, density, temperature, Whereas, few examples of vector quantity are, displacement, velocity, acceleration, weight, force, 